As you know, parole is a privilege. And one of the restrictions on any parolee is to avoid the company of any person who has a criminal record of any kind. That would include most of your extended family. Yeah, that's obviously not something I'm proud of. Would this pose an impossible challenge for you? No, no, I, I, I don't want that life. I never wanted that life. My brother, um, may he rest in peace, was a, a criminal. He, I loved him, but he was, um, he was a con man. It was in his blood. And it's not in your blood? No, no, sir. Um, I fell for the wrong person. It's a mistake, uh, but it, it happened. And um, if I were to be released, I would, um... sorry. Wow, just saying that. <sighs> if I were to be released, <clears throat> I would just want the simple life. I just want to hold down a job, make some friends, go for a walk after work in the fresh air and just, you know, pay my bills. Simple life. Nice one. Heard about that? Who didn't? I had five years to rehearse it. Here's your stuff. Thank you. Nice watch. It's my brother's. Left it to you? I stole it. It's fine, Dina. You stole it too. We're still gonna get a regular shipment next week. You take your cut, plus a few extra cartons, okay? I want you to trade them, I'll smoke them. So where are you going? Well, I have 45 bucks, Dina. I can go anywhere I want. Do you have your receipt? No, but they're unopened. They haven't been touched. I really need your receipt. They are sealed. They are brand new. Uh, do you have the credit card that you use? This is ridiculous. I, I bought these last week. Maybe you can try client services on the sixth floor. No, no, no. Never mind. I'll just keep them. Jesus. I can at least get a bag. Sure. Thank you. Hi, Monica. Hi. Hi. Uh, we just found out our flight was canceled. Oh, no. I know. I know. And instead of staying at some horrible airport hotel, we were hoping that maybe we could get our original room back. Yeah, we can give you that same room back. That would be amazing. You better be in there. I know you're there, Reuben. You can come on out. What are you doing here? The shoplift? Maybe. No, see, this is what you do. You make me guess, and then I'm interested. Okay. And then you think because I'm interested that I want to do it. And don't you want to do things you're interested in? Well, I'm interested in brain surgery. Well, but... we know that's not going to happen. Oh, my God. Closure? Oh, shit. We're not robbing a museum. We're robbing someone in, in a museum. A museum, yeah. In the 90s. Oh, my you God, all the so Edwardian collars and the ruffles? Travis. Like, oh. you're... <laughs> you're fascinating. That's it. You're gonna throw me one dub for a metro card? That's it? How about this? We steal $50 million, I'll buy everybody metro cards. Is that your brother? Mm-hmm. It's hot. Mm -hmm. You sure he's dead or? No. What, told you the truth? <clears throat> Only way to con a con, right? Half an hour. Countdown starting now. <sighs> okay, first. No need to be nervous. The food is better on the inside than most people think, and even solitary can be kind of peaceful. I just want to say thank you. The last three weeks have been amazing for me and we've all worked very hard for this moment 
So whatever happens tonight, I want you to remember one thing. You are not doing this for me. You are not doing this for you. Somewhere out there is an eight-year-old girl lying in bed dreaming of being a criminal. Let's do this for her. I hear your Schneider. Oh, here it is. Have a good night. Thank you. one of us. How about some of it? Pathetically, 10%. You would have loved it.